What's up, guys? Welcome back to Comic Swag. It's your boy Mike. Today, we're going to be talking about Swamp Thing Green Hell, a fantastic looking comic that came out this week, written by Jeff Lemire, artwork by Doug Mankey, and the colorist. Man, he did a fantastic job. I gotta give him some credit. His name is David Barron. Um, the artwork and the colors was, was icing on the cake for this issue. The writing was excellent as well. But man, those colors and the art, man, <laughs> fantastic. So let me get on into the comic and tell you what it was about. So what is Green Hell about? It's a post-apocalyptic type of story. If you read The Masses or maybe seen Waterworld, that's what's going on. The water is beginning to rise. There is less and less land for people to inhabit. People are starting to fight for supplies because less land means less food, less supplies, right? So they're beginning to fight amongst one another. We have one group of people that live on this island, and they're friendly. Something happened to where they don't want to use weapons. They do have some buried, but they don't use them. And we have another group of people that live on this oil rig, and they're ruthless. They have weapons. They don't care. They will kill you. They'll take what they need to to survive. So we have two opposite type of groups. People on the oil rig are demanding the people on the island to pay them supplies every month. So they show up for their supplies. They're a little early, and the people on the um, island tell them, hey, you're a little early. We still have time. They get into a fight. We end up learning that their brother-in-laws, the leader of the oil rig, and the leader, I think he's the leader of the island people, they start fighting amongst each other, right? They start throwing some blows. And uh, the people from the oil rig, they leave. Tell them, hey, we'll be back. We want our stuff. But the next time, we're going to just whoop your ass again. And uh, the people on the island are over it. They start talking amongst each other. There's a small group that has weapons that pull them out of the ground. Basically saying, we're going to attack them. Everyone else is like, hey, let's not be like them. That's not the right thing to do. They just try to find supplies. But, nah, they're over it. So they end up attacking the people on the oil rig. The small group goes out there, ends up slaughtering everybody. But here's the twist. The tree of parliaments are over the human race. They want to start Earth from fresh. So their plan is to kill off all the humans. So the leader, the brother-in-law, is turned into a swamp thing. And they're going to use him as their weapon. And he ends up attacking the islands and starts fighting everyone. Starts killing a lot of people because it's time to annihilate the human race so the earth can start fresh and be reborn that's kind of what it's about there's also a cool little twist at the very end two characters i didn't expect end up showing up i don't want to ruin it you got to read it to find out who they are but let me show you some of the artwork and the colors because man that is the icing on the cake as i mentioned check it out here is a father and daughter donald and veronica they're out fishing looking for supplies pretty nice just flip open to another page or two. I don't want to ruin too much for you guys. But here, here, check this out. Yeah, the people from the oil rig, they end up showing up, right, demanding their goods. Here by my finger is the two brother-in-laws going at it. Uh, yeah, so we don't know what happened. Uh, here's kind of the tree of parliaments, right? We have the red, the green, and the rot. They're discussing about um, killing off the humans because they're ruining the earth. Here is, uh, here is the group attacking the oil rig people. You guys can see right there. The dude dies and he ends up being turned into. Check it out. Swamp Thing. Pretty damn nice. Artwork is fantastic. The story itself is great as well. No complaints there. And here we are. They're being attacked. They're on the run. The daughter ends up running away with this guy in the red shirt. His name is George. They end up escaping, and um, yeah, let's check this out. Here is Swamp Thing attacking the island. And I don't know if I'm going to go too, too much further, because I don't want to ruin it for you guys. Uh, let me look for a page that could go a little bit further down, without ruining it for you guys. But here, check it out. So the George and the daughter end up escaping to this small island, and we're introduced to a character who I don't want to mention, you got to read it to find out yourself, but I highly recommend it. It's a black label, magazine size comic. It's $6.99. Once again, Swamp Thing Green Hell. Pick it up. I highly recommend it. That's my comic of the week. That's all I got for you guys. Peace out, people. Catch you on the next one.